Good kitten internet. Meow. Uh, it's been, what, a week and a half since we so, last did Something that? like that. I've been at my place for about a week. And I've been here not playing any games. <laughs> Where we last left off, Scow. They don't like me. And I have a bounty on my head. Yes, but the captain ordered the crew to stand down so we can take whatever we want. Exactly, and we just finished taking whatever we wanted. Which is why I'm just walking back. Eh, not even worth the effort. I can't actually loot them. Hmm. Is there anything to loot over here? I mean, there are... That matters. No, not really. I think That's a if... one-way door? An automatic door of some variety, but... Hmm. Kind of curious to see what's over there, but... Yeah, I mean, you can explore the ship more if you yeah. want to, but... <laughs> That's right, there's an actual named NPC down here. Somewhere. The floor above. Oh. But you've talked to him. Ooh, what a plumbing deck. Why is there gunfire? Shooting at the Xenogram? Maybe. I thought those were. Pets. That succulent looks dead. I'll rescue it and give it a new home. I just noticed it. Novice? Novice. You do. Definitely know your way around a lock. Yes. Don't you? Hello, Xena Crab. You're lucky the captain's a coward. If it were me, I'd say we go a few more rounds. What do you want? You've won. I like him. He's handsome. I still want to know what's that way. Yeah. Uh, quick save. Yep. Toggle flying cam. Well, just toggle collision. Yeah. I quick save, so if it goes to nowhere, then not a big deal. Well, these exist. Like, there's actual stuff here. Maybe there's just a switch you didn't see or something. Is that uh, one of the other docking ports? Must be. Because that's a docking bay, but not the one for us. How, huh. did, how did Sarah get in? She, um, she opened the door. She opened the door. How did she open the door? I don't know. I guess there's a switch somewhere that... Or maybe when I open the switch down here, it opened both doors. I don't know. Pull the switch. Nope. I've got nothing. Just gonna remain a mystery, I guess, because there is no switch. Can you close the door? Like, look up. Nope. No, it is. I don't even see where the door went. It's up. Oh, yeah, it's up there. Nope. Mm. Filthy pirate. We're not gonna forget this. That's probably another docking port then. Yep. Wait. No. Wait, isn't the one this is the one that I came from? No. Your sister lost one. Okay. Weird. The I thought that's where the sweet rolls were. No sweet rolls. It was in a series of lockers and near the exit. 
Ah. Sweet rolls. Yeah. And a plunger. And a post-it note that says sweet rolls and a question mark. And a foam cup. Wash your damn hands. But you won't let me. Anyway. I'll head to my crew position. I forgot to start the timer. Well, go ahead and start it. We have been recording for five and a half minutes. So, 54. All right. Now, I am not going to UC space. No, you should go, go anywhere else and get that bounty cleared. Particle turrets? Mm hmm. In the event that I attack? Yes, in the event that. Um... Oh, and the scow is going away. Because I'm not moving. <laughs> it, it remains there, by the way. I figured that. But, okay. yeah. We need to go to a settlement. It can be one of your outposts. You can build one there. Yeah. Or I can just go to the Narian system. Right? I'm trying to remember... Oh, the Star Yard might have a bounty clearance thing, yeah. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Because there's no actual settlement. Actually, wouldn't the clinic have one? I don't know. But I think the Star Yard has one next to the mission board. Mm -hmm. I seem to remember there being a second board, at least. Also, at this point, can't I pick up my new ship? Yeah. Because I actually have the Class C license for it now. Yep, and that's your ship there. Oh, is it docked? Yeah. Right there? Me. You see the allied symbol? Can, uh, it, can you target it? No. Oh, now yep. it can. Kepler R? Mm -hmm. Level 1. What happens if I were to blow it out of the sky? Then you don't have a ship, and you might get a bounty for attacking a friendly ship. Probably. You can dock to your ship. Yes! We are doing that! I don't know what in the world's going to happen from it, but we are doing it. This is an awkward angle. <laughs> Jetpack oh, wow. damaged or something? Who builds four stories with a single ladder going between them? I don't know. Especially when there is more and they just only like, staggered the last one. The ladder placement specifically is idiotic and the cooking station in the kitchen doesn't work. Well, that's obnoxious. You can make things... And you get the XP for it, and it takes the ingredient away, but you don't get the thing you made. <laughs> <laughs> Worst cooking station ever. Yes! <laughs> I mean, it looks neat. At least it didn't work on my... Uh... I mean, I guess I can always try it at some point. I don't have enough ingredients to do any of this, but... If you made it your home ship, you would. Probably. Probably. I mean, you just need... Water and a membrane to make distilled water. Oh boy, delicious trawl. Slurp down a tube today. No, thank you. This area looks familiar. Yep. Is there also a safe down there? Yep. Yep. The captain's quarters. Mm hmm. Ooh. Is there anything in the uh, cargo and captain's locker? Captain's locker is empty. Cargo. I thought it was there. Where is um, it on it this? It might be. Yeah, there. There. Yes. There's actually a lot of things in here. 
No ship, no ship parts though. Mostly a curiosity to see if these will return when I um, come here for real, so to speak. using the ladder animation. Uh, how do I get off of the ladder in between? Uh, sideways, maybe? Or space? There. Space did not work. It was just using up boost for no reason. Hmm. Like, what's the purpose of this? It's to add more height. Because I bet height-wise I need to be up one more. Mm-hmm. Just like the purpose of this room is to have enough height for the Razor Leaf's docking area. Okay. Undock, then dock to the actual thing. The station, yeah. Yep. The words, they come and go. There's oh, one. I'd be very huh. concerned about the new Stroud Eklund This model. place is something else. Are you ready? If you need anything, just ask. Let me show you our stock. So is it not appearing here? There it is. The Kepler R. Yes. I mean, it doesn't look terrible, but it is awful. Doesn't look that bad. It it looks like it's fifty percent tech. I had to cut corners somewhere, right? Anyway, there is not a board here, so this does not help. Oh, there's one in Aquila City at least. Yep. <laughs> By the way, since there's at least one person watching this video series beyond the person sitting to my left that has played some Starfield, if you have any suggestions for places that have like nifty things that you've encountered, let me know. There's a lot of random encounters that one or, or that I've definitely not seen. There's a chance that they may not have seen them either. Okay. Seen a lot. How many boards in the kitchen post? Yeah, let's say in the bar. There are a lot of bars. Yes, but, but this is the one I was thinking of. For their own safety. Hmm. The uppermost one of those. Um. What button was it again? Z. Push and hold versus push. Really? I will pay the additional 10%. That's fine. Okay. Now I can go back to... Yes. You're over encumbered, so you can't fast travel. Thank you. People joke. Say those perunes. I am hitting it repeatedly, and it's only you working. You didn't have once. enough power for it. Oh. I guess I'm just not covering it fast enough. remember to actually dump things out of my inventory. Hmm. 
Mm, you're having that glitch where your character appears darkened mm -hmm. in the inventory. I've had that quite a bit. I don't know what causes it. Alright. Going back. With a lodge. <sighs> See, this gives away that I know that something's going to happen. Yes. I know exactly what's going to happen. I would hope that you would know. You've been here a lot. You've done this three times. Mm -hmm. Make a hard save. And then do your thing. I think so I think something's happened. Noel was just talking to Vladimir. Something's wrong with the calm to the eye. You have to put the artifact. Yeah. Wait, why is Vasco Noel still here? Seems to be distressed. <laughs> if the modulation of me. her voice is any indication. Vladimir. Vlad, come in. Come in. The eye's gone completely dark. I I can't reach anyone on the station. Noel, Starborn, came out yeah, of nowhere. Surprising. Vladimir, get out of there! He already left, said he was going to, uh, to the lodge. Are you? What did you do to our friends? They call me the hunter. And now that I'm here, your part in glimpsing the unity is over. I should have used precognition. Yeah, you should, but I think a lot of these probably have future uncertain. Vladimir's right. We need to fortify our position before that starborn storms in. We move out once the artifacts are ready for transport. What about everyone on the eye? We can't leave them to die up there. I understand if you want to go, but I need you here. Please, I... I don't know what's going to happen once that Starborn shows up. I don't know how long it's going to take to pack up the artifacts. I... I'll get started. Hopefully this will only take a few minutes, if my hands can stop shaking! Everyone, oh. find a place to Sarah take cover! Sarah is going to punch Wait, the hunter when he arrives. You really expect them to barge through the front door? Just don't stand out in the open, Walter! Walter, are you all right? Hello, again. I'm all done. Just a bit longer. Oh, there's never. <laughs> No, 
noticed how low my health is. Yep. Oh, there's multiple of them. That explains why I'm taking so much damage. Do I seriously not have a better weapon? Stop! Just saying, heart plus is right there. Fine. You have a lot of hit points. Persistence. <laughs> he doesn't seem to be affected by reverse yeah. traffic. I know he resists most powers, I think? Maybe all? disappeared? I'm not telling you anything. This one? Yep. You probably didn't hear it, but they're escaping through the passage oh, to the yeah. wall. The passage that's been locked that I've been wondering about for a while. Mm -hmm. I don't know if he's gone, but we can't risk it. Get to the ship! Well, Walter survived, so that's a good sign. Come on, Vasco. You're a part of this, too. Hi. Will you stop getting in my way? Also, you healed, you... Seriously, Sarah. I'm just saying, running is an option. Come on. It'll be a lot easier if, if you I have a Still makes more sense. Basco. I don't even need a gun. Fire! Fire! Oh, people have been killed. Yeah. That is almost unavailable. Will Unless you are really good. Give your best shot. I am not high enough level to be that good. Well, his level is rubber banded to yours. Last time I did this, he was level 138. With this many hit points? Probably more hit points. Well, I meant yeah. by comparison. Bring it on. You've got nothing. The artifacts are mine! Oh, you're summoning more of you. Yes. You're done. Huh? 
Hopefully nobody major was killed. Nice to meet you. I think anyone involved in a quest is probably protected, so they're not gonna die unless you kill them. They're just respawning perpetually, aren't they? Yeah. Oh, fine. going to show up in my ship now as well. We need to get to the eye. Help the others. What if that starborn is still alive? It we is still alive. It. They could be dying up there. Starborn encounter in space? Yeah. Combat. No, he gives you a trash rifle. What? <laughs> How does this make any sense? disappear. Alright. I... up in this case so I can talk with people aboard my ship. Presumably more than and all of them should be aboard, right? This is a rescue operation. Move quickly. God, I hope they're okay. We'll keep the ship safe. You do what you do best. Why are you angry about that? Yeah. You don't really have time to sleep. 
I have all the time in the world. This is Bethesda. I, I know you do. Where's Mateo? Yeah, and where's Vasco? Yeah. I mean, well, Vasco, Vasco might be in the landing, bay, right. but where's Mateo? Is that star stuff? Yep. Maybe he didn't make it on board. Ah, there are people in the cockpit. Time is not on our side. But I had enough time for now, it's fine. Dad! Get up! Sam! Sam, can you hear me? It's Sarah. He can't. This is it. I've never had the animation Sam. play correctly here. Cora will be fine. Okay, Sam? Dad! Dad, get up! Get up! Please? Like, she is supposed to sit down and cradle him in his arms, so if he starts moving it's because his part of the animation is correctly working. Go away! I told him you were coming! I hate you! Leave me alone! You're alive. Krix's ghost can keep waiting. Not many sights to see before I lost the lights. Can't be sure yet. Starborn could have done a lot more damage. Guessing the glitter of the prize wasn't here. Saw the ship dock with the eye. We took up the arms call, but when the doors opened, there was no one there. They were invisible. Sculpt in like a damn specter. Before I had to know, it was nothing but pain's wings and a cold sleep. Time's unknown, but I came too long enough to hear him gloat about going to the lodge and seeing our friends trying to crawl away from him on a bloody trail. No tears for the old. Got the others to worry about. Hello, Andresha. He came. You've I literally fought that. like a dozen of them by this point, I think. We were working on the repairs when the ship docked. We ran to defend the station, but after the doors opened, there wasn't anyone there. Then all of a sudden, Vladimir screamed in pain, and I saw him flying through the air. That's when I saw the Starborn. It went very quickly after that. I only saw the one. Thank you. Uh, I don't think I can move right away. But I'll make it. Go on. Okay, I admit, uh, my famous personality wasn't so much help with this one. Besides the big ugly one, not that I saw. Starborn ship came in nice and quiet. Just happened to look outside and see it docked. Everyone came running, but uh, no one. Doors open, no one there. Vladimir took one step towards the ship and then boom, he's in the air. Slammed those impressive triceps on one of the consoles. Cloaking the vice, maybe? Or one of those powers from the artifacts? Guess they're more than just a party trick, huh? 
I'll be fine. I just uh, need to lie down for a bit longer. M. My husband. Come on. I know you're going to get back up. Vladimir. Oh, thank goodness. Where's Sam? He's gone. <laughs> that was really we... bad acting. Yeah. <sighs> we need to talk locks and bolts. Lodge and the eye are not secure. That's why I made you save, by the way, because you can saving, but... Got the right of it. The hunter, he, um... He probably found us because we're somewhere obvious. High populated area, just like how the Starborn found you orbiting Neon the first time. But the fact that they're competing with us to find the artifacts means they can't get them without searching. So we put the artifacts somewhere in the fringe, or on something that can slip from their grasp if they do another strike from the curtain. Clear from the few encounters we've had that the artifacts are all the Starborn prize. They could come after us, though. Try to find out where we put them. Need to take the risk. The eye, the equipment in the lodge, not easily moved. Gotta hope whatever is giving the hunter pause applies to the hole. Just need to make another direct hit less the jackpot. Fine idea. Starborn show up, you can burn helium in one spin of the grab drive to anywhere. Here, keep the artifacts safe. I guess we'll meet back at the lodge after. So, like I was trying to say, you can save Sam, but only if you leave everyone behind at the lodge. And that means someone else dies instead. What the hell? One companion always dies, and it's one of... So if you read this and went to the eye, instead of defending the lodge, then Sarah would be the one dying. That is garbage. It's cruel, yes. No, I mean, that's garbage gameplay-wise. You can't be at two places at once. But yeah, I, I think it's garbage that... Like, Sam would die even if you had given him... 20 med packs and everything. That makes me not want to play this game. I was afraid of that. At all. Because, like... There are games, I will say this spoiler-free, there are games that do the whole, hey, look, you have to decide between one of these two, the other one's going to die thing. Mm-hmm. I think it's cool. There's lead up to it. It's just, it's not just all of a sudden, hey, look, wonder attack. Uh, decide right now. And you have no idea what you're actually deciding. Like, I did not know in the moment, not only, hey, look, Sarah's at risk, but also Sam's at, there was zero hint of that, other than there's a lot of blood everywhere. That's not the way the, a game should be working. That's a ham-fisted attempt at making things more serious. Yep, it is. So, what are you going to do about it? It doesn't play very differently if you go to the eye first, because when you return, you go through the same chase sequence with the hunter. I mean, I guess I'm going to let Sarah die. The problem with letting Sarah die is the glitches that come from it. 
At least I had a lot of glitches from having Sarah die. Such as whenever I finished a new um, storyline, quest line, and the talk to this companion, talk to that companion. Mm -hmm. I got to talk to Sarah and she's not in the game anymore. Also, after uh, her funeral, she was forcibly assigned as my active companion and I couldn't switch companions and I couldn't dismiss her because she's not in the game anymore. Yeah, I really don't want to continue the game. Well, then we're not continuing the game. It just... I understand why you wanted to delay this to the last moment. Mm -hmm. And I appreciate you not giving me any spoilers about it. Oh, I was scheming. Remember when uh, I, at my place, asked you to send me the save so that um, yeah. I could scout out locations? Mm -hmm. That was a ruse. I was looking up everyone's affinity. Mm, but and, you were surprised and... that it was Sarah. Yes, because... When I checked, uh, Barrett's affinity was slightly higher than Sarah's. But Barrett was not with us in the lodge when you said the thing that everyone loved. Mm. And those parrots got slightly higher than Barrett's, and she was the one going with you. Gotcha. So I had, like, accepted that Barrett would be the one to die, probably. But nope. Because, I mean, I can reload... Go back to the lodge, run, go out to the eye, save Sam. Yeah. And then when you get back to the lodge, Sarah is dead. But that doesn't make any sense gameplay wise. Because think about it from how long that took. And I stood there and fought my way out rather than running. Mm -hmm. That was a minute. Or two. Uh, no, I. This was bad. Mm -hmm. Well, we might as well see the other direction and finish out the video, but really don't want to. Make a save here in case you decide to go with this outcome. I don't want to go with this outcome because of Korra. Exactly. And my first time around this, it was between Sam and Barrett. Mm -hmm. I was like, I, do, I can't do that to Korra, but also, why are they taking Barrett from me? And so I went to an earlier save, and I had Sarah with my com as my companion for and a really long time. And that's when you got time. all the glitches. No. Because I wanted to get Sarah's affinity up high enough where the choice would be between her and Barrett. Mm. So the person with the highest affinity is the one that's on the eye, and the person with... The second highest gets with you to on the mission to the scow. Okay. Kind of surprised it wasn't Andresia at that point. Like, I know we checked Andresia's affinity and... Yeah, it was, was 190, and... Before the event at the lodge that people liked, uh, Barrett's was 210 and Sarah's was 200 or something like that. Gotcha. So we were really close to having it be in Frasia instead. And my other two characters have sacrificed Andresia because it seems like the easiest loss. I mean, if Sarah dies, Barrett is very sad about it. Yeah, I don't want to continue right now. Okay. I might come back to it, but that really put me off of wanting to play. And to be fair, I was already starting to have more and more issues with the game. Like, the way it was presented, the way that so little attention to detail happened for most things. Mm -hmm. It was already starting to bother me more and more, and that's part of the reason why I was trying to rush to the end of the game. It wasn't just... Yeah, I know, I still have like 15 minutes, but I know it wasn't just the fact that I, the series is, not very many people are watching it, to put it mildly, 
but also I wanted to be able to do another video game series sometime this year. But yeah, nope. I'm going to go ahead and stop this here. Okay. Sorry, Internet. I'll talk to you next time with something. I don't know what. Bye. Bye.